Hello friends, this is Rar. In this session, we will discuss about uh, uploading image in SQL Server using ASP.NET with C Sharp. Uh, so, I have created the four fields which is uh, blog ID, blog head, blog description and uploading the image by choosing the file and then I'm going to click the save button. If I so, so click the image, with, click the button without saving any file, it will show error. So, look at this. I have created the blog table and insert that I have four fields which is ID is the integer data type and block head block description and block image or the bar care so just I'm going to show this uh, I have created this uh, as integer data type and bar care for the block head and the bar care max or the block description and image is the bar care maximum so for that I'm going to upload the images in the images folder and going to save the path in the table so for that I'm going to just getting the map of the image path as name equal to server dot map path map path which is my images folder is the map path okay and just telling that it is a path so after that I'm going to check whether the file has or not so if it is having so checking the condition file upload one dot uh, using the method has file whether if it is having then if it it will return true if it is not then it will return the false statement so if it is not found I'm just showing the error message in the label one which I have created so label one dot text equal to place select file just I'm showing the error as a please select a file okay if it is having then I'm going to get the extension of the file for the getting the extension I'm going to retrieve has a string ex3 equal to for getting the extension you have to include the namespace called uh, system.ivo you know that uh, namespace is a logical grouping of classes so in that uh, I have a system.ivo I should have to call this and going to get the extension of the file so part dot so uh, string ext equal to part sorry which part part class I have to call part dot get extension and getting the extension of the file name which is uh, file upload one dot file name okay file name just enclosing it and after that I'm going to check if it is uh, uh, JPG or PNG file if it is not then it will show the error I'm just going to get the extension of the path file is uh, JPG and PNG ext equal to equal to double quote jpg double quote or ext equal to equal to dot png okay then just I'm going to check whether it is a jpg or png file if it is not then I'm going to show the message there are message as label one dot text equal to you have to upload jpg or png file only and just showing this message okay then after that if it is jpg or png file uh, contains uh, then I have to use a method called file as so file upload one dot save as save as path which I have created the path plus file upload one dot file name okay then after that I'm going to get store the file path into the database so for that I'm going to create in the string getting the string in the called name equal to double quote images folder in the folder I'm going to save the file upload for example if I have a name uh, 
example.jpg then it will store as uh, images slash example.jpg so for that plus file name which is file upload one dot file name okay file upload dot file upload name. then I'm going to get the sorry inserting the value in the table for that I'm going to write the query and getting the query in the string itself by naming the SCS equal to writing the insert query as insert into blocks I have to write the table name I'm just going to pin this and insert that blocks okay insert into blocks and the values are and the fields which are ID comma blog underscore head and blog underscore description comma blog underscore image which are the fields in my table and going to set the values which are single code double quote plus text to box one dot text plus double quote single quote comma single quote double quote plus and the blog head in the text to box two dot text plus double quote single quote and the block description is in the text to box three dot text plus double quote single quote comma and the images I have created in the string getting the by name okay plus double quote single quote you can find that I have created in the name get the part of the image uh, stored in the string value so I have retrieved in the in this place because I have to save the image for the, in the table so that I have called single code double code and I have to enclose this and double code and finishing it just saving it after that I am going to implement this uh, query in the SQL command so SQL command cmd equal to new SQL command I'm going to write the query which I have get in the SS string comma oh, connection giving the connection okay simply saving it and uh, now I'm going to uh, open the connection for implementing this as uh, cmd dot uh, execute none query okay then after that I'm going to close the connection as con dot close okay then after that I have to show them message successfully it has been saved so I have to show the message in the label one dot text equal to double quote inside that I am going to save the, your blog has been created successfully okay okay then after that I am going to change the color of the text label text which is by default it has been in the red color so I'm going to change it as uh, level 1.4 color equal to system dot drawing dot color should be a green green okay after that I'm just simply saving it um, my browser is open just I'm going to refresh or simply closing it and newly I'm going to run this and going to fill out those uh, fields which have a blog ID blog name and blog description and this so just saving uh, giving as one blog head is uh, sample head and this is sample description without uh, choosing a file if I going to click the save button it will show the please select file and uh, if I select the .jf format uh, it will also show the error message has uh, you have to upload jpg or png file only so you have to select uh, only jpg file which is a beautician file I'm going to select this you can look this uh, it is a .jpg file so I'm just clicking and uh, going to click save button it will show that uh, your blog has been created successfully you can look at uh, now I'm going to refresh my project and going to refresh this you can see that uh, I have uploaded the s4.jpg file it has been came here 
so it has been successfully uploaded in the folder called uh, images file and you can check out this uh, path has been uploaded in the table yeah I have uh, got this one yeah guys hope you enjoyed if you like this don't forget to like share and comment and subscribe it have a good day